guys, welcome to today's video. Today's video is where I am the boss of this family and not anybody else. She licked it a little bit, but it, it got on me. Oh, I see where she's licked it. Yeah, she's I licked it. it. Ew. That was probably Sophie. No, Good girl. Oh. Do you like it? I, I've heard that sometimes if a horse is you deficient in salt. I've heard sometimes that when the horses are lacking salt, which we give our horses salt in their diet, that it can make them spooky or trembly and all that kind of stuff. So let's just see how that works out. Salt. You might not know, but Gabby burnt out the light last night. If you saw yesterday's video, you might have seen that we bought some pool noodles, really cool ones to make jumps with and to make like an obstacle course. I'm gonna get some more stuff and we're gonna do this. Like this is gonna be fun. Anyway, welcome to today's video. Today we are on the go. Today is an on the go day. If we didn't have so many on the go days, I don't, I don't think I think that, I think, I would think that the world is broken. But yeah, let's do it. Let's get this day going. So You've heard me say it before, and I'm gonna say it again. Every day holds the possibility of a miracle. I'm not joking, guys. Wake up, go out there, and see what God has planned for you today. Sometimes you have to look harder than others, but just look around you and see the one thing that God has planned for you to see. Stop eating horse poop. Okay guys, change of plan. We all actually had five halters, soon to be six. Okay, good job. Somebody said that they felt like Willow was a lot more quiet and settled now that Stella's gone. And a lot of us said, yeah, it's sad. Yeah, honestly, I, my, her, our little herd is quiet and calm all the time, and I know that Skye has introduced that emotion to our herd, because that's how she is. But it makes me sad. It makes me sad that there's no fun. So you're in a hurry. Well, you better calm down. We're all friends around you, just join the fun. Cause if you're in a hurry, you miss a little one. Gabby's not done. Big surprise. Shocker. Yeah, shocker. Um, this is kind of a mess over here. Whenever the chiropractor comes, or the vet, or the, or the farrier, or the trainer, I always feel bad. Like our barn needs to be super clean. Anyway, we have to go because we got to go to the other barn. I'm excited! I get butterflies every time we're gonna go see our boys. Like, I love Chino. I think he's amazing. Like, I love Finn. I love Storm. There. Whoa. Whoa, she's like, okay. Mom. There, it fell on the floor. Pick it up. She has such a tiny one. Oh, don't eat my fingers. Mom, <laughs> I wanted to give her that. Are you jealous? 
Yeah. Jealousy rules pony. the world, ladies. She's my pony. But she can love everybody, and she does love everybody. Can I have some more for the others? Yeah. I don't mind you doing them because they're evil. Evil. But you're so cute. You guys have the best birthday present for Gabby and for Sophie. Sophie's birthday is not for a long time, and I am so excited of when I'm getting her. Hoping to have time to eat before we have to leave. Because this mama is hungry. Who's my favorite mare pony? Great Yes. Guess Willow. Pony. Willy, Willow. Gracie. Yeah. Oh, Finn. Ooh. Mare. Ooh. Well, who's Mayor my favorite? Pony. Um, horse at the other barn. All right, let me turn out the lights. Grab my mitts. Your favorite horse at the other barn is Finn. We yeah. know you guys. We know. Who's my favorite horse? Uh, Stella. So some exciting news. I have to watch down, you guys, otherwise I die on the ice. Some exciting news. Gabby's going to show a winter series coming up, I think, this month. She's going to show both our horses, like both Chino and Finn, I think. Come um, on, Gabby. Sophie's going to be a couch potato. She only likes summer shows. I'm um, with her there. Warm. Yeah, it's hard. Like, winter is hard. But anyway, Gabby, but Sophie... It's better because you have to wear a jacket. Sophie doesn't want to, and that's okay. Gabby does want to, and that's okay. And plus, guys... Do what you love. I'm not ready for Trillium. Yeah, then that's there's okay. there's no hack in Trillium. Yeah, I think there is hack. Oh. Well, I can go to Trillium. <laughs> do you want to go to Trillium? I can do hack. Who would you Who would you ride? Storm. Storm can't go to Trillium. Storm likes hack. He likes hack, but the... Uh, the arena, like the, the, you know, where you ride, whatever that thing is called. It's okay, guys. It's so my, huge. My thighs would die. Yeah, yeah, like he doesn't have the paces. He doesn't have the stamina he to, uh, or he just won't. Mom, anyway. it's fine. I'll ride Finn. Ooh. Me and Finn will be bolting down the arena. And yeah, and that was Gabby last year. Anyways, so Gabby's going to show a winter I series. On. I controlled him. One when time, he did the they won second place. One time they won second place. Oh my gosh, there's so many things I always want to share with you guys. So I'll wait and I'll do that in a minute. Okay, so, okay, we're at the barn. I lost my keys there for a few minutes. I was freaking out. You guys got to see me freak out. I, I can really freak out. But anyway, I found my keys. Usually I'm so good about my keys, but then something will happen and somebody will be involved with me losing my keys and that's how it happens. But anyways, I wanted to talk to about, I wanted to share some tea. Okay, so last night, I was laying in bed, all just lying in bed, minding my own business, and somebody sent me a message and said, hey, there's a new channel, and it's called Horse Talk, and it had 28 subscribers, so I was like brand new to the channel, and it is made, it, it was made by Danny the Horse Girl, you guys know her, um, it was made by Danny the Horse Girl's mom, and it was like eye-opening when I watched this, this video that she posted called Horse People Suck, it was... Wow, like she was brave and went out there and she was saying things that other people want to say but never say and it was pretty, pretty, pretty crazy. There's the kitty, <laughs> the parade, the horsey parade. I'm grabbing my coat. Okay. Storm, you were rolling. Oh no, he was sleeping in the shelter. Oh, he was sleeping in the shelter? Okay, I'll be right there. I'm coming. Finn kept walking away from me. Uh oh, he's... He's tired, probably. He's like, my muscles hurt. My horse. Oh wait, he didn't even feet. ride yesterday. Can I see my horse. Yeah, I'll come out and vlog you getting your horse. So put them in the stalls. I'll be right there. Anyway, I shared this channel because I think it's gonna have a really strong impact, and I think that there's things that this lady says that we all need to hear. People are talking about it on our channel, and in our comments and on our Facebook page. Our Facebook page is really different. Like all of our audiences are different. Our Instagram page is different our tiktok page is different our facebook page is different our facebook page i feel like we have the longer more in-depth conversations and my instagram and tiktok are younger viewers it's just it's just fun but anyways people on our facebook channel are talking about this channel in great depth and i feel like the reason why a lot of people have such different opinions is because everybody hears something different when they hear when they watch the same thing. I think people think this lady is out to hate and bash on certain disciplines and certain ways of riding and I don't think that's it. I think what she's actually saying is that we need to stop with the bully mentality. People who try and convince you to do something or believe something 
that is their way is the right way and they do it in a way of exclusion and you're excluded from the group if you don't agree. People who take a really strong presence about their opinion. Um, I feel like that is a bullying mentality and that when we encourage that bully mentality, we create an entire generation of bullies and I think it's getting worse and I think that's what she's kind of trying to say is that not that anybody's bad or anybody's not good, is that we need to stop the mentality of the way that we are encouraging each other as equestrians, that we need to be supportive and kind and any single time anybody ever comes at me with any opinion in a forceful way, be it a vet, be it a doctor, be it a teacher, be it a, another parent, being it a coach, being it like anybody I meet in life, when somebody approaches me in a forceful way, I stop right in my tracks and I say, whoa, you need to wait because everybody has the right to their own opinion and you should be encouraged to form your own opinion. Everybody has the right to share their opinion and talk about their opinion, but nobody has the right to force it on somebody else. Nobody has the right to make you feel excluded because you don't believe what they believe, because you don't dress the way they dress, because you don't do your hair the way they do their hair. Nobody has the right to exclude you for any reason other than you're being mean to them. So I think basically bullying, the bullying mentality has to stop. And I think that this lady on her channel, her name is Katie, I think maybe she could do it. Maybe she could, maybe this, maybe this is the beginning of changing the way we interact with each other. And I think that as equestrians, we should set the bar. We should set the stage. We should strive to be a better community because I mean, horses, come on. Anyway, that's the tea. That's what I wanted to tell you. You guys should check out her channel. It was a pretty eye opening. Like I was like in bed watching the video going, oh my gosh, things are gonna get crazy here. But you know what? God gives us crazy sometimes to really get us where we need to be. So check it out. It's called Horse Talk. Danny the Horse Girl's mom, Katie, made this channel. Let me know what you think in the comments below, though. I'm really interested. All right, let's get on with the video. Gabby's going to go get Chino, and we're going to see if he's still coming to her or if he'd rather have his friends now. You know, a great way to... You want to ride Vinny around bareback? I think that'd be so fun. She drinks. She sucks on her tongue. Does she? With her tongue half. Look at the way you're out. Yeah, look at her mouth. That's funny. She's like, don't look. Hey, look at me. Uh -huh, I know. Don't make fun of me. Yeah, I, I touched her tongue before. You? <laughs> Ew, oh, Sylvia. Ooh. <laughs> she does it. Look at her. She sucks her thumb. Her tongue. Her tongue. I don't think she has a thumb. All right. Hello. Oh, no. Lily's like, I'll go. Did the horse will push you off to the round I want to go in, Mom. So that's Chino and his girlfriend. I want to go in. If you didn't catch it in. That's Chino and his girlfriends. If you guys didn't catch it in yesterday's hilarious lesson video then you might know that fiona's fiona's talking about the fact that she knows oh he likes the mint fiona is talking about changing chino's field which i'm okay with but i like where he is right now to be honest if you're in a hurry you miss the point should enjoy the fruits of life instead of chasing Couple kisses. Uh huh. It's in back. So I 
watched out because he was ready to bite my face. Wow, people really want to bite your face. Maybe my face tastes good. <laughs> Maybe you it does. I'm cold. I'm not going to make it. Okay, hurry up. Get them in here. Okay. Ooh, we forgot our blanket here last night. And somebody lost their glasses. Ooh, that's interesting. Who do you think these are? Let's try them on. What do you guys think? Do they look good on me? I can't actually see. I actually like them. I, I wish I could see in them. Hopefully whoever's glasses these are, don't watch this video. Do I look weird? Look at Finny, do you recognize me? Those glasses make you look weird. Ooh, they're strong. Gabby, what do you think? Your glasses, I hate them. You hate them? I can see good in the camera with them. Sophie feels like Finn doesn't love her now. He feels like he does. He does. He's mad that she didn't say hi to him. So she's gonna do a TikTok that's gonna prove that he loves her. If you guys wanna see it, follow Sophie on TikTok. It's gonna be on her channel. Hey, what is it? What is it? Sophie and Finn. Sophie and Finn on TikTok. Super pony. No, he's my super pony champion. He's Sophie's super pony. He is gonna be Sophie's step he wins up pony. With me. After Sophie learns everything she can learn on Storm, just like so Gabby had the opportunity then to do I that. Learn everything I need to learn on then Storm. she's gonna end up with Finny. <laughs> Job. I'm gonna play this one with a halter or nylon. Put a blanket on. Amazing. Got me. You. All right, you go get Chino ready and let her play with her pony. Gabby finally posted her first TikTok and it is adorable. That's a hint, it was adorable. Okay, so we are home, skating on ice here. Everything is melting. Um, and we, the chiropractor followed us here and we're gonna do Sky. It's gonna be her first ever chiropractor visit. Sure, find a good spot. Sit down and join us as we sing a good song. 